talking about me a PC? Okay. All right, so let's start with the case. What do you want? Ooh, I know. Something not too boy racer. Okay. Stylish, subdued. Okay. Right. Small. Uh-huh. Quiet. Basically just perfect in every way. Really? What? You know what? I actually have something for you. Look, check this one out. The Nano S. What do you think? Does it come in purple? No. Why not? Look, it's cool. It's like a mini version of mine and that's awesome. Look, I mean, it's not the smallest build, sure, but at least it'll stop you from complaining a few weeks time. Oh, my computer's too slow. Oh, we won't do this. Oh, you did such a bad job, Ash. Really? Yeah. Look, all I'm asking for is a Hold good on. computer oh. that will I'll work be right. and it will... Okay, so that's gonna take a while, but just to catch you up, this is a productivity build. She mainly wants to use it for CAD and design work, but at the same time wants it small, discreet, and powerful. So, you know, not much to ask for. I'm gonna go for a mini ITX build with the option to expand in the future, so here the Nano S is a great choice. It offers a number of ways to install the hardware whilst keeping things clean and spacious. I should probably get back to Ash, it. are you playing with yourself again? No! Ooh! Time. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Is it done yet? Well, I literally just got the parts. I'm taking a breather. Is it going to do what I want it to do? Yeah, trust me. I got it. Do you get that new Titan X? You know that one that you really, really wanted? No. Why not? Because you don't need it. Why not? Look, I got you something cool. It's the 1060. Just came out. This one from MSI comes overclocked. I don't even know what that means. Okay, so when NVIDIA release their cards, they all come at a standard frequency. So later on, when OEMs release their cards, they all come with unique features. And this one, in this case, being overclocked. So it's mocking my run now. I'm feeling so fine. It's mocking my herb, my herb, my herb. Hey, you even listen to me? Look. So, as I was saying, there's this new blade design so it comes quieter. Plus, there's this thing called instant performance gain. So, in a click, you can either have it silent for light use or max performance for, you know, when you need it. Um, you can change the color of the LEDs. <gasps> now, that sounds much more like it. So I'll be able to have Photoshop and Illustrator and they won't crash right when I save yeah, things. You know what, hold that for one sec. And oh, look oh. at videos. Wait. It's like blah, 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 such a headache. What she doesn't know is that I'm going to install a Hue Plus box from NZXT just to please her closet boy racer dreams. She'll go nuts. Where'd you keep going? She'll go nuts for it. I'm coming, I'm coming.
Is it done yet? Uh, uh, yeah, actually, it is. <gasps> Can I paint it purple? No! Can I use it as a bookshelf? I've got loads of books. No! Will you run Crisis? You know, hold on. Oh my god, where do you keep going? Are you hiding something from me? Is it just me? I don't think she fully appreciates what I'm doing here. Anyway, the parts, the reasons I chose them. Okay, so the 6700K is to give the most performance from what mainly will be CPU driven tasks. This is the main reason why she wants a new PC. So I thought it'd be right to out for the build, but something that will give performance without costing as much as a workstation PC. And to keep the CPU cool and quiet, the Kelvin S24 from Factor Design is an easy choice. It's simple and that's what's needed here. There's no weird software, is expandable for future use and a 240 millimeter radiator fits like a glove. There's there's two lovely looking RAM sticks from G-Skills that balance price with good timings. And for storage, I chose the 850 EVO from Samsung. It's fantastic for the price and her needs don't justify the features and price hike of the 850 Pro. Finally, I chose the Integra M 750 watt power supply, also from Factor Design to help balance the power whilst keeping things stable, efficient and quiet. It's pretty short too at 140 millimeters, which is perfect for this build. Wait. Housing everything is a Z170 motherboard from MSI. It just has everything she wants and could want for the future. Plus, it never hurts having a nice color theme that you're going for. So all in all, this thing is looking good. Ash, look, look, I've got something to show you. Wait, um, were you talking to someone? No, 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 what's up, what's okay, up? Come look, close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes. Sorry. All right, come on, get a bit closer. <gasps> I mean, don't get me wrong, I love what you did with it, but it was just missing a bit of sassiness, so I added a few decorations. It has a unicorn horn! I know, it's awesome, right? And you've got Chewbacca and some feathers and some bunches, and you know, it's awesome, right? Uh. Yeah.